at that time, we needed to get fuel into the first responders in Fort McMurray. The RCMP asked for our help. We knew we had stranded motors that had, did, had run out of fuel as well. So we put a big effort into how do we get fuel into the area. At the time when things were evacuating and we needed to work with the, with the government and the authorities to get access to bring fuel in, but we got asked for some support. We donated fuel to the RCMP, the local uh, firefighters and the first responders. We donated fuel to a stranded motorists and we brought it to them on the road, you know, because they, they were stranded and, and without fuel, so we brought it to them on the road to be able to do that. We provided jet fuel and aviation gas to the fire bombers in Fort McMurray as well. So it, that was, you know, a, a great industry collaboration. We were the ability to provide the fuel but we had to work very closely with the authorities who needed it to find access to get the fuel into, the, into that site at the time when we were really evacuating. And of course, the people who actually did that and brought the fuel in deserve a lot of credit as well. They had to wait for when the road was open, when it was safe to get it in and get it out, and then go and actually fuel the stranded motorists as well.